What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here, and we are playing some RimWorld. This is the 1.3 Ice Sheet game. Triple Cold snapping it. And we're getting more goodies coming in from our one single solitary grow room, which I've been considering making a second of, but I don't think we need it because we're getting by just fine. We may have enough plasteel to accomplish our task. The only thing we may be short at this point is an AI Persona core. These dudes have been outside for a good long while. 16, there's a social fight between Dale and Carney. They're at it again. Buttheads, let's not destroy each other's gear. That's uh, Chief Importance Black, you. Good, I want you to be our tender. Trying to get somebody else skilled up recently, decently in medicine. You need to go inside. Cloth button shirt has broken down and deteriorated. That's fine. What are you working on? Making some shells. That's nice. So, we found the plasteel. It is here. I have marked it. <laughs> we can deep drill there at any time. I'm going to kick this off. It would have been nice if it was closer, but in a pinch, I'd say we're just, we're just fine. We're not going to have any issues there. And we're making a little bit of kim fuel out of our rice stash, which is overly abundant. I'm not sure why Carney stopped cooking. Never mind, he is still cooking. Do we have any fine meals? It seems like we're not able to keep up on meals like we used to. I'm not sure why that is. Probably because we just hit a certain number of people. Which, it's slowing down research, but Boyro should be on top of that. So, we, good thing we've picked up additional people to do these tasks. I've been kind of picky about it. Uh, arena, you can go outside again if you want. It's everybody, everybody can. Let's see what happens if we send everybody outside. I believe I canceled all the jobs for priority hauling that were over there. I wouldn't mind nabbing these, though. They're relatively close. And... We're pretty short on block thanks to having to build traps like nobody's business. I guess we're not pretty short, but relative to where we were at one point, we are short. So let's go with that. I didn't force you to cook, did I? No. He's just doing it on his own here. Okay, and what if we go check our bill here? Yeah, let's uh, let's reconnect this and... Part of the reason I'm doing it is using up some rice. I did recently switch a few egg Holy shit, that didn't sound good at all. Fucking A, it's always outside, right? Everybody get out there quick. It doesn't sound a huge issue. Batteries are coming back to life right away because we have a ton of power. Right. Those are almost non-events due to that, but whatever, it's fine. Why are we putting shelves inside? I wouldn't really like to see that. <laughs> I can avoid it. We should double check. People are outside quite a bit here with these blocks. I'm going to schedule everybody inside except for the folks that are in really warm clothes. So getting those guinea pig park has made a massive, massive difference. We're working on researching the last item for the ship, which should be the computer core. I should be able to put here, and I'm assuming we're going to get 10 people because that's where I was going to draw the line on this one. With the limited ability to grow food, it doesn't make sense to be just taking every single pawn that comes along like I typically might. Or every single, let's go with halfway decent pawn that comes along. But regardless, here we are. The batteries did not charge. The power took a shit. But the lights are on. I don't think we have any real issue here, but I'll keep an eyeball on it. And hopefully we can just be done with the bringing in of blocks. I, we have so much steel, I'm half tempted to start making traps out of steel for a while. It'll have the benefit of reducing our wealth quite a bit, if we can burn through a ton of that. I mean, it's nice to have steel on hand, but do you need about 9,000 plus Another 3,000 down there. We have so much. Nobody ever made it out there for that deconstruct, huh? Irina, health. You are inside. Nicole, what's wrong with Carney? Is he beat up from that social fight yet? Yeah, okay, that's fine. All right, and we still have 134 Nutramines, so we need herbal meds and cloth and we're, we're working on it. So we'll get all those eventually turned into meds. It's a significantly cheaper way, if you have the manpower and the ability to make a few small things, to get medicine. So I've never really go... Oh, mira, mira. Anybody out here? You. 
Let's uh, let's take a stab at this fucking polar bear, dude. Where'd he go? She. There she is. Charge. Uh, drafted hunt. Drafted hunt. Cut it off. Cut it off. You just gotta piss it off. Ah, uh, it's out of range. Damn it. She might get cold here. Health. She's shivering. She's at 5.7. Just fucking shoot it. Make it mad. Nice. <laughs> Alright, now you can come back in. Alright, you go in. Uh, we could use a couple backup people. You two of the... You should do the job. Oh, Irina's actually one of them. I want... Uh, I don't know how I even caught that polar bear going by, but there it is. I mean, you can just try and give it a couple of shots if you want. You're outrunning it. I think she's going to take it out. I think it's well cold. Yeah, it's seriously hypothermic. <laughs> I don't think we need Nicole out here, but I think Irene is probably minorly hypothermic any moment. Here. Beautiful. Good job. Finish it off. Nicole, you're in. Look at that! A fucking polar bear, dude. <laughs> it's the first time we've had a major animal show up. That's glorious, and I love it. Uh, too heavy outside of a loud area is the real issue, even though it's not telling me that. It did tell me that, actually. What am I saying? I'm like, all right, there you go. So uh, I think Kearney will get on top of that when he wakes up. He'll be stoked to get the butcher a fantastically large, beautiful, and endangered animal. <laughs> Although in this game, it's not considered endangered, apparently. We do have some more blocks up here. These were not all brought in. There's still one chilling right there. Okay, fantastic. Oh, we do have this door I never put back in either. <laughs> Should probably get that done at some point. There you go. All right, well, security's back online. They'll slowly build those traps. It's about time we started building those inside. I just found it pretty frustrating when people were always stepping on traps. So there's that. Now what's Carney up to? Viewing art. I just want to see him butcher up this bear. Cooking. Nah, scrap that. Butcher bear. Let's see what we get for this. How much meat comes from a single bear? 111. And then we get bear skin. Nice. Psychic suit female. That's great because we have mostly female pawns here. So what's Arena doing? She's sleeping because I kept her up all night shooting at a bear. You can see how our wealth... After we smelt a bunch of shit. So raid comes in. You can see this is telling you there was a raid. That's the wealth that came in with it. And then we smelt most of it off. I don't think the carcasses on the map count as wealth. I don't think. How come Nicole wasn't getting any more hypothermic? But Irina really, really is. I really have to babysit her out here. This one turned out very different than my previous attempt at this game and that's kind of cool the way these bases have to grow i don't know almost organically you know you start at a center point and you have to grow outwards to keep your warmth in and you have to keep it small consider what you're doing and all, you know all that kind of stuff i think it's interesting how these work that's another benefit of not having played this this scenario very recently I need to do a count on what I need for plasteel. Those don't take any. 140, 280. Son of a biscuit. Let's schedule everybody to inside warm so nobody goes outside. I, we're, the plants are just forsaken. And I guess we can see if anybody can make it in there for a harvest, but it's not going to take long before it's over. No. Now we got a little bit, but... Whatever, it's fine. It's not much of a threat like it used to be. I mean, it's neg 90. and I mean, it's getting worse, but by the time the solar flare ends, we should be fine. Everybody's super happy for some reason. Was there a wedding or something I missed? Oh, there's a psychic suit for females. Trapped indoors. That's not great. Dolly, anybody getting cold yet? I still need that bionic hand. I put places in here for bionics. They're just not, they're not making any, so. Let's uh, make sure it's obvious what those are for. Although this one being blue isn't obvious at all. I don't know if you can name two the same. Let's see what happens. No. <laughs> okay. That's uh, an interesting restriction. 
That feels like some uh, cargo pods, you say. I mean, it's not great, but it's certainly not bad, especially for Tooks. We'll just sit on that until our heat comes back online here. Is anybody getting cold? I'm just debating on whether I even have to set the fires up. You are shivering pretty significantly. Okay, I guess we'll bite the bullet and set the fires. As soon as I do, the damn thing's going to end, but there it is. At least we'll have a warm, lighted room for these fools that are too cold right now. Someone's going to have to walk through the fire. No, no one's. Okay, uh, I can't get anybody in there at the moment without doing this. All right, and then I think I had a zone that was that room, so let's double check that. Plants near base, inside, inside, cleaning, safe warm. All right, let's just put everybody in safe warm for a few minutes and see if we can't warm up. Maybe we could close the door. Ah, uh, so Carney Health, he was getting it bad. All right, he's recovering. See, as soon as you do that, uninstall these. What is this doing here? I don't know why that statue's there. Uh, and you also have to tell everybody they can go. Defoliator. That one is close enough. It's going to get our plants. We're going to have to deal with that. I want to schedule you and you to be able to come out here and get this stuff. So, what is this? Lancer. So it's another shooty bunch of butt sniffers. We have the means to probably stand. This is relative. Where the hell are you going? I mean, I guess. I don't really want that steel. I'm going to forbid all the steel. Same for over here. I don't want anybody running out for that shit right now when it's totally unnecessary. And there is that thing which we were working towards a long time ago. All right, so what's its current radius? Radius expand rate nine per day. And it's already at seven. And it will go to 100 based on our previous experience. So volcanic winter. Jeez Louise. It's really, uh, that's going to make this a colder winter than we have ever had here. Yeah, that one is definitely going to get our plants. So that one's 50 right there. I lost it. <laughs> All right, we'll just redraw it. It's fine. Yeah, so right here is 75. It's going to go way into our plants. <laughs> We're going to have to do something about that. I'm going to start by uh, mortaring them, I believe. Arena, you're resting. I'd like to wake them up at least. Left pinky shot off. Let's man this. Uh, don't really want that shell in there. Extract that shell. Black. Are you going to put it back in? No. There's no shells in Black's allowed area. Alright, whatever. We just need to wake the fucker up. and Should do it, as long as Black doesn't freeze something important enough. Yeah, those are good against people because they start them on fire, but... Alright, it's awake. We didn't do any damage. I'm going to disallow those. Actually, we, we could do it here. That's whatever. Just shoot another. I don't think those even do any damage to the bastards. Didn't do any damage to this. Sure looked like it hit it. Black, how cold are you? Oh gosh, go inside, Black. <laughs> Alright, uh, inside. Alright, carry on. I'm going to try and destroy it and make them come for us. We have a pretty significant amount of security at this point. I think we could take these botheads. I don't know that we're ever going to get six shots on this thing. Probably it makes more sense to aim more in the center of where the beasts are. Because if we can do more damage to them, I think we're going to be better off. Nice work! Look at that! <laughs> that was glorious. Good job, Nicole. All right, and let's uh, let's kick this on because we're gonna need to be making more shells. That's good. It'll eat up a bunch of our steel. All right, badass. As long as she doesn't get too crabby or cold, we'll be fine for a couple of minutes here. 
She wants some food. I'm gonna have to send somebody else out there. Alright, one more shot and she's free. Where'd you go? The barrel wore out. How many shots do we even get? 20, bloody hell. But good thing those a-holes brought us three barrels. <laughs> the seizures. So that's nice. All right, you're free, Nicole. Uh, you know, Irina. I don't think it matters what there's... Irina is outside probably cold already. Eh, whatever. I had to watch it. People are out here constructing. Oh, she did manage a second hit on it. What does this show me? It's not the radius. Although something was expanding there. It is the radius. Look at that. It drops off at 50 because the game can only handle it. Nice work. 50, uh... Sorry. Can we get these put away? The game can only... I'm in like three different spots at once. Can only handle a radius of around 50 to 55. Alright, she found none because somebody picked them up. I'm going to send somebody else over there to start that. Uh, yeah, there you are, Nicole. Health and needs. Forget that steel. Anything else you're holding that you don't need to be holding? I'm just going to stay on top of this. It's, i got to watch the rice. If we burn up all of our rice trying to make shells, I don't think it damaged either of the bastards that time. We need four more hits on this, and hopefully in that process we wound the snot out of these guys. Looked like it hit these guys head on. Did nothing. Hypothermia. Inside. Ah, damn it, I sent her inside and she immediately comes back out to work. It's my fault, not hers. Alright, I let her go free. Hopefully someone's making more shells. Not too quick. Alright, let's stop cooking for a little while. We've burned through everything we had. We do have that doomsday. I wonder if we could creep close enough to... This would be a great time for that. What's the range on that thing? It's like 35 or 36, I think. The problem is, we, yeah, it's 36. We have to get close enough to not get our asses handed to us by those dudes. Another problem is, like, trying to draw a diagonal range. All right, so let's just do 35. So if we were standing behind here, we could peg that, that thing pretty well. Also, if we were standing over... But they're going to come for me as soon as I get close. So if we were standing like here, ideally I would shoot the, the beasts because the beasts are the threat right now. We only need three more hits on this thing though and we got it licked. So anyway, what's Nicole doing? Can we get back to business here? Somebody, Man, those things go slow. Nicole, I would rather if you were over here doing this. So do we do we use a doomsday while they're all still grouped up? What I should have done, oh, that looked like it hit them, but nobody ever takes damage from these direct hits. I don't understand. I think if you actually hit one. Nice work. Oh, it didn't hit this. It looked like it hit the, oh, whatever. Well, that one did. <laughs> uh, okay, last one that we have around. Boo and hiss. Now we do have more. They're actively making as many as we need at the moment. So... We have 2,500 rice, which is plenty for the moment. As soon as these guys get, the, or the ship gets destroyed, I think, we, I think we send everybody inside to try and warm up. We turn on our guns and pray to God we don't get killed when these dicks come for us. They're, they don't have a lot of wounds. In fact, they're all in pretty solid health. And these little bastards have managed to escape our... See, that one looked like it hit something. I don't know. Maybe I should build walls or barricades or something around so it has more to hit. I should have built some barricades so we had somewhere to hide. Nice work, Nicole. You can go do something else. All right, one more shot on that. And it, right now, the radius is not scary. So Thank God go. it was a defoliator, not a psychic ship. Our moods are not where I'd like them to be. I don't, they were so happy before because there was that psychic... BS going on. Dolly, you might want to go out and man that. Boyro might want to go out and man that. I don't think they can be out there nearly as long as those other people. But at least we can get rid of the cabin fever issues. Now if we wake the buggers up right now. Or, sorry, destroy their... What they're guarding. Why is it... Can fire. Poof. Ah, you blow. The barrel's down again, dude. 
these things are pretty I mean can I don't imagine you can make those barrels either where did you get that barrel from and is there another one around here I swear we had three okay so it might be wise to buy a few of those and Boiro health shivering 20% I'm gonna let her all right awesome there's some research done shoot it go do what you want go see where it's all right that's it people here they come <laughs> everybody inside uh, I need somebody to turn on our guns that's uh, gonna be Nicole flick that switch over here you go I wouldn't mind another one of these belts usually I don't use them but I think in this situation they're nice can we just not go in that bedroom I guess not <laughs> They are coming for us, right? Yeah, but not too quickly. I'm going to restrict everybody to inside and then just let them do their thing. They might sleep. They might do whatever. But Let's see if the base can defend itself. I do have to go, though, so please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. I appreciate you guys being with me today. I love you all. And I'll, Oh, we do have one more barrel, and I'll see you next time.